What's up, y'all? Thank you for stopping by again. I haven't done one of these in a while, but I'm doing a wet sole video. So let's get started. <laughs> I sold this My Little Pony on the eBay. I got it for $1.99 at Goodwill. And I sold it for almost $14. I did a 10% off sale. They paid the shipping, um, which was $4.90. It looks like it's gonna cost me $3.77 to ship. So I probably made about 10 bucks after fees on this. For $20, I sold this brand new, still sealed um, Terminator series it's a tv series the sarah connor chronicles season two i paid 4.99 at goodwill and i sold this for 20 dollars on ebay they're paying the shipping the shipping on this is like two dollars and 80 cents because it's going media mail so it rattles i can't help that i actually sold this phone nana that's a phone banana bluetooth speaker for $18. I had it listed for like $26, $28 based on the comps. But when I plugged this in to charge it and the speaker quality to me was just crappy. This is just, it's a novelty. It even says it's a novelty somewhere on here. I don't remember what I paid for this. It was in one of my more recent videos. I got this at Goodwill. I think it was like for a couple bucks. So it's a good flip and it's lightweight. They're paying the shipping. This is an eBay sale. As much as I wanted to play with this faux Nana, it's gonna have to be faux somebody else. So at an auction, um, I had won this um, wall hanging with uh, plates. It had four monkey plates. It was like not iron, but it looked like black iron. So a black metal hanger that was vertical and it held four of these plates in a row. And um, the hanger was about four feet tall and I don't want to mess with shipping at. So I just listed these plates for, for $39.99 for $40 on eBay. The buyer paid shipping. This is going FedEx home delivery. So I've got to get this packaged up. I paid $6 for the four plates and the hanger. Um, so turning $6 profit into 40 is a great flip. Um, it's kind of a hassle to package these, but it's easy like anything else. And I am going to see if somebody else wants the stand locally. Maybe I could sell it for 10 bucks. People hang plates and stuff all the time. So you never know. I mean, you could use it for picture frames or whatever you want. Anything if you want it. I have no idea how to ship something like that anyway. Okay, next. I got these uh, as part of a storage unit clean out that I did a long time ago. Money's been made back, so this is pure profit at this point. Um, I sold two sets of these, um, and that's all I had listed on eBay as a quantity of two, and they bought both. And when I went to pick these up, I realized I actually had three more. So I went in and posted those. I thought about reaching out to the buyer, asking if they wanted more, but I just decided no. I guess I won't, but they paid for the shipping. So that's going out the door. I'm glad to get these gone because I've had them for probably a year now. So I got to shake them up, make sure the lotions haven't settled. I sold this cross stitch pattern on Facebook Marketplace. $20. I paid a dollar to garage sale. This is fire. So I got this brand new at a garage sale in a haul that I had listed before. And I think I paid about a dollar for it and I sold it on eBay for 16. I had it listed for 18, but I took a best offer. So they're paying the shipping. That's a excellent flip. And I do believe I had four cross stitches and this is the fourth to go. So we're done with these. Bolo, always get your cross stitches. I also listed a couple of things that I bought at a state sale this past weekend and sold them already. I don't have it with me, but it was two PNY memory cards that I got for 50 cents. They were two gigs each and I sold them for 13 online um, on the eBay and I paid the shipping. So I made money, but not a lot on that. Um, at the same sale, I bought this Sony. Um, it's a plug-in adapter slash charger for a uh, video recorder deal. I got this for a dollar at that same estate sale 
and I sold it for $32 and they paid the shipping on eBay. The other thing I sold that I didn't take a picture of was a brand new pack of four micro cassette tapes. They were brand new from Panasonic, I think. I sold them for $10 on Facebook. So I basically made $10 minus the cost, which was about a dollar. So I made $9 on that because Facebook doesn't take off fees. And then I bought this Moonlighting CD a while back at Goodwill. I think I paid $4.99 for it, and I sold this for $33. Moonlighting, you guys remember that with Bruce Willis and Sybil Shepard? Yeah, so I sold that. I did not do a haul from an estate sale that I went to, but I got a lot of DVDs. So from that, I've sold quite a bit already, surprisingly. Um, this is a Murder, She Wrote DVD that I got. It is movie collection is what they call it. I thought these were TV shows, but not movies. I don't know. Anyway, I sold this for a mere $9 on eBay. I paid a dollar for it at the estate sale and they paid the shipping. So this is going out to Robert in Michigan. Thank you, Robert. Appreciate your business. I also sold this Route 66 complete third season for $18 on eBay. They paid the shipping and um i paid a dollar for this at the estate sale it has been a while that i purchased and listed this it's an angel ring holder it's silver plated um i said it was vintage probably i did that because i got it out of an estate sale and it's marked a dollar fifty so i sold it for eighteen dollars they paid the shipping and I am about $15 profit in on this because of fees. Uh, I sold this on Mercari. They take 10% plus, now they take 2.9% processing fee plus an extra 30 cents for everything that someone buys now. So they're competitive now with eBay. The last things that I sold on Facebook Marketplace are two of these, which are hair barrettes. This pin goes through the hair. Um, I sold both of them for $18 each. And then I also have a red one that I sold for $18. So those are all going to three separate buyers. I'm getting ready to ship those out. That is it. Thank you so much for watching this video. I appreciate you taking time. If you like, the what sold videos i'm going to put a playlist of those right here and if you haven't subscribed and would like to over here is a subscribe button that you can just click on thanks again say hi in the comments if you haven't already and i'll be seeing you in my next video okay y'all bye